and welcome to my channel overcoming gluttony my name is Alicia and I used to weigh 327 pounds I currently weigh 274 pounds and on this channel I vlog every single day so that you can have a place to come to and get some quick encouragement for when you need it, for when you're about to just bust loose and blow your goals, right? So, like I said, I vlog daily and we also grow microgreens on this channel so that we can keep some fresh nutrition at our fingertips. I weigh myself on the 1st and the 15th and each week you all get to look inside of my refrigerator and my food pantry and see what I've eaten throughout the week and how I organize my life. I want to let you know that I was successful in regards to my 2023 goal. This morning I drank about 75 ounces of water during breakfast and I ate four servings of raw vegetables as well as walking one hour before I went to work. Now, what I wanted to chit chat with you all about today is losing battles. Losing battles. None of us are perfect, so we can expect to lose some battles. Many of us have lost a ton of battles, especially when it comes to our weight. Now, just because we lose a battle, just because we indulge or go overboard or stop working at our goals for weeks, months, years at a time, doesn't mean we've lost the war. We should expect to lose some battles. And the area where we really need to grow is getting back up and choosing not to lose the war. So I know at times we may take a break from our health goals. And as we take that break, we get bigger and bigger and bigger right so rather than assuming that you're just going to lose the war or that you're going to put it off until after whatever after whatever event occurs or whatever just recognize that it's okay to lose battles because we're not perfect what we need to do is get back up and fight to win the war. Just because you lose a battle doesn't mean you need to stay down. Just because you eat too much at a certain restaurant or you indulge in some ice cream or you go back to your old coping habits or you miss out on the gym for the whole month doesn't mean that you need to just lose the whole war and give up on yourself and make things harder for yourself in the future. Just choose to get back up even if you have to limp. And what that looks like is if you're used to walking two hours a day or going to the gym for two hours a day, well, do some makeshift or alternative physical activity. Rather than expecting perfection from yourself, just look for steady growth and steady implementation of discipline. Improving your discipline will help you win the war. So next time you make a bad choice, which we will do, we will do that. Just recognize you lost the battle, but not the war. Have a good day. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.